Assalamualaikum and very good morning to Madam Rohana and to all my friends. My name is Ikwan Amir bin Fatur Rahman. Today I would like to explain or my presentation is about patient complaint. How me as a manager handle patient complaint in a hospital? There is a few steps. It is impossible to make everyone happy at all of the time. And complaints are bound to happen within the medical fields like doctors, nurses, physiotherapists, radiographers, or maybe cleaners, and also hospital manager like me. We as a manager should always stay professional and handle them in a way that benefits everyone. There are few steps or few ways how to handle patient complaints that will leave patients happy and feeling satisfied and heard. Before I go to the steps or ways to um, handle patient complaint, I will explain why do patient complain or the reasons of patients are complaining. Number one is a lack of clear communication. Sometimes patients didn't hear clearly what the medical staff are explaining to them. So they tend to complain that they don't understand the procedure or what should they do. Number two is personal belongings being lost. Sometimes patients are clumsy. So they tend to lose their personal belonging in a hospital. So they might complain at the at the manage, at the hospital management of the stuff that, that they have been lost. Number three is unclear about the procedure. For example, patient undergo MRI or even X-ray. So if they went to X-ray, they they need to change their clothes to the hospital clothes or hospital gown. So sometimes patients are complaining because they don't understand why they need to change their clothes. And they don't understand the, the x-ray procedure. Number four is failure to meet patients' expectations. Different patients have different expectations. Some of the patients expect the government hospital will treat the, the patient as the, the same as how the private hospital has been treated. So, we go to the first step of how to handle patient's complaint. How me as a manager handle patient's complaint. Number one, listen to them. As a basic it may sound, but this is the first step and the most important step when dealing with unhappy or angry patient. Most of the time people can control their emotion, so people just want to vent their frustration to someone, to a person who willing to hear. So it is good if you as a manager just hear them out. Most of the patient is in the need of attention. Be sure to give them your undivided attention and keep eye contact to them and truly hear what they are saying. Do not argue with them or pass blame to them and be sure to control our emotions. Summarize what they have said to you or said to ma hospital manager so they know how um, so that they know that you are listening to them. Remember that our ultimate goal is to retain the patient. The second step we as a manager must acknowledge their feelings. The first one is being empathy to them. 
because empathy is a key when it comes to successfully handling patients complaint maybe you can offer the some cold water or cold or, or maybe coffee so they can reduce their anger keep in mind that this person is in this person is a patient so they they may they might feel not well and they just want to uh, receive they, they just want um, to relieve their stress and also maybe they just receive a unfortunate diagnosis or they, they, may, they might be just um, going through an accident so just um, talk just be empathy to them they might be uh, they might be um, frustrated with their condition put ourselves we must put ourselves in the patient's shoe and let them let him or her know that we understand their frustration presented in his instance demonstrate to them that the manager care and um, hear and know and understand his or her feelings are valid the third step is ask questions to them get as much as many information as as possible this will best help uh, make the manager and staff to figure out how to handle the complaint and avoid any issues that we don't want and or, would, or could arise in the future number four explain and take action let the patient know that the complaint is being taken seriously and we as a managers will suggest a solutions explain that explain that it will be reviewed and discussed among the management inform the patient that we as a manager will follow up with them we will do a follow up and within with with them after after the complaint has been thoroughly investigated investigate but what happened if there is a situation where they went overboard like yelling to the manager or to the staff or even put their hand on the manager or the or medical staff the best solution to this is do not fight with them and let them let the authorities handle the situation such as most of the hospital they have a police inside the hospital last but not least thank the patients always say thank you to patients for taking their time to speak with manager and also maybe they complaining to medical the other medical staff so just thank them and bringing the matter to man, management attention ensure they understand that their satisfaction and their complaint are our number one priority and patient is the and patient is important to the management to the hospital management that's all from me. Thank you very much.